This stuff is creepy and it is insane. Clearest, clearest portrayal of this from the LA Unified Schools. LA Unified Schools has a video out to promote their new policies for how they're going to reopen after COVID. Now we know from the science, capital S, trademark over the E, we know from the science that there is no medical reason for the schools to remain closed. The kids don't really transmit it very much. The teachers and faculty are not at any particularly higher risk of getting the virus. The reason that the schools are remaining closed is because corrupt left-wing teacher unions are too lazy and they want to get a paycheck for doing nothing. So LA schools now are, are pushing, how are we going to reopen? And it's, tell me this isn't the creepiest thing you've ever heard. There's never been anything like this virus in our lifetime. Often, it's hard to see the effects it's having on our children. Has this conversation taken place in your home? Mom, I'm scared about going back to school. I don't want to get sick, and I don't want to get you and Dad sick. Our scientists tell us there are three things we must do to stay safe. Wear masks, make sure we social distance, and wash our hands. And now, your school, with the help of Microsoft Corporation, has created another. Introducing Daily Pass, your exclusive ticket for safely going back to school. Each week, you can schedule your free on-campus COVID test. The results are displayed in your Daily Pass. And if you choose to take your test off campus, you can post the results in your Daily Pass. And the moment vaccinations are available, you'll simply be able to schedule yours through your Daily Pass. But the real magic is your daily health check. Just answer a few simple health questions every day, and like magic, your entrance ticket appears. It's so wonderful. Just give us access to all of your medical data, and I don't know, send us some of your blood too, and then do, 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 do. Then we can all go back to school and give us all your rights and don't have any privacy anymore. Does this ever happen in your home? Hey, mom, I'm really afraid of coronavirus, and I. I'm so afraid of going to school. No, that doesn't happen because kids don't feel that way because kids are at practically zero risk of this virus and they all want to go back to school and their rates of depression, anxiety, suicide among kids has been going up because of these psycho politicians and the technocrat in tyrants in lab coats like Dr. Fauci who are screwing up their lives over nothing but a power grab. That's what's going on. Not that creepy video. It gets somehow, somehow, it's even creepier by the end. So, how did it go? Dad, I have to admit, I was scared at first, but then I felt so safe. It was so good to be back. Thanks for keeping me safe. I love you so much. <laughs> what? If you're going to push this kind of creepy propaganda, can't you, I don't know, get better dialogue? Dialogue that doesn't send a chill up our spine? Thank you, Bill Gates. I mean, Daddy. Thank you. Dr. Fauci. Oh, daddy, daddy. I keep meaning to say daddy. I, can I call him daddy Fauci? Daddy, daddy, Dr. Fauci. Uh, no, uh, this does not represent the situation that we find ourselves in and it doesn't represent the situation we want. That's the kind of radicalism that is being pushed, not by the fringes. It's being pushed by the liberal establishment. We need to head them off and stop them every chance we get. If it's by shooting down a nominee to some office in the government, if it's through elections, if it's through civil disobedience on our own in prudent cases, such as going back, living our lives, seeing our families, taking off that dumb mask. Makes sense to me. I'm Michael Knowles. This is the Michael Knowles Show. See you tomorrow. Freedom! If you enjoyed that break from disinformation, historical revision, and screaming about the end of the world, be sure to hit the subscribe button so that you never miss another video.